Major changes for one of the biggest truck series teams in NASCAR. It's good news for some of its drivers, bad news for others, and one-time enemies are now teammates. This video breaks it all down as the green flag on the season is just days away. What's up everyone, I'm Alan Kavana. Thank you for joining me on here. I hope you consider hitting that subscribe button because there is so much NASCAR news still coming out even though the season starts next week. When we woke up this morning, we still hadn't heard the official news for Thor Sport Racing, one of the mega teams in the truck series. Well, today we found out and there are some major changes. First and foremost, Thor Sport is switching over to Toyota. That's not entirely surprising as we knew their relationship with Ford was ending and all signs pointed to this happening. What is surprising is the driver lineup. Johnny Sauter, Matt Crafton, and Ben Rhodes, they stay in the trucks they've been racing in the last few years. The 98 truck though, that's where it gets interesting. The 98 truck has been piloted by Grant Infinger for the last few years. Last year, he was the regular season champion and even made it all the way to the Phoenix Four after getting this win in Martinsville. Enfinger is back in the truck, but he will split time in that ride with newcomer, Christian Eckes. Eckes comes over from Kyle Busch Motorsports where he had a decent year last year, but not the success he wanted. Tentatively, he will race 10 of the races in 2021. That leaves Grant Infinger with just 12. So how did all this play out? How does the regular season champion one year go to splitting a ride the next year? Enfinger says it all starts with a reduction in sponsorship. You know, obviously the, the pandemic last year played a Played a, played a big factor in, in a lot of things. Um, Champion was, was on board, I think, for 11 races last year. They're doing seven races this year, so we're, we're continuing that relationship. It, it, it is a demotion to, to be running part-time, but, you know, it, it's part of it. It's part of uh, rolling with the punches. Uh, this is a, the, the whole racing deal it is such a roller coaster of emotions. You know, whatever, two, three weeks ago, I didn't know if I was racing and figured I'd just be on the couch watching all year, so... Um, yeah, no, I'm very grateful for the opportunity and you know, I fully intend on, on taking advantage of it and, and trying to uh, keep the career going. Um, you know, the opportunities are so hard to get uh, nowadays in the truck series and above that, uh, you know, I need to really take advantage of this one and, and prove that I belong. Here. Something else to point out here. Racing is a really interesting world sometimes. One of the more memorable incidents of 2020 came at Texas Motor Speedway in the truck series when Ben Rhodes and Christian Eckes got into it on the track and then nearly came to blows in the pits after the race. Well, now those two drivers are teammates. How will they deal with it? We asked both of them today. Yeah, so I texted him the other day. I finally responded to his text that he sent me, I don't know, about four months ago. Um, I, we'll go get some dinner or something and, and smooth it over. But, you know, at the end of the day, I was in 2020. and um, Yeah, rough deal, but whatever. Team first. I need to um, have a run-in with somebody that I really, really like this year. That way they can become my teammate because in the past couple of years, I get into a run-in with Johnny Sauter for, for two years in a row, I think, at, at Canada, and then he becomes my teammate. <laughs> and then, uh, obviously, Christian and I had a run-in last year, and now he's my teammate. But I, I'm proud to say that, you know, Johnny and I started off on, on a rough path, and now I would consider him one of my better friends at the racetrack. Um, and I hope to, the same can be said you know, with Christian and I. So what do you think about all this? Let me know down in the comments. Grant Infinger, championship contender, now in a part-time ride. Christian Eckes calling this a good second chance at his career. It'll be an interesting year in the truck series, something close to my heart, of course. So make sure you hit that subscribe button because there is more news to come, even with the green flag just around the corner. We'll see you next time.